Williams at Six Flags, get ready for a kick of competition, courtesy of PBA Team Bowling. Bring that kangaroo hop, baby! <laughs> Sean Rash bowling anchor for Carmen's Cartel. Walter Ray Williams Jr. bowling second. So it is spare, open frame, open frame to start this one off for Ross Raiders. Jason Belmonte could make it a three-bagger for Carmen's Cartel right now if he can drop all ten. Come on, baby, now. Try and give me 10. <laughs> uses just his two fingers. His thumb does not go in the bowling ball. He uses both hands. Check out this power. Come on, baby. Oh! Chasing the 7-10 late. Folks at home. This Jason Belmonte, naturally right-handed, rolls with both hands. Oh, God. Close them up. I, I don't get tired of watching him roll that way. Just team shootout earlier. Randy caught up with World Bowler of the Year, Jason Belmonte. Jason Belmonte from New South Wales, Australia. You got your invite through the USBC. Formerly the greatest amateur player on the planet, now a PBA member. Talk about your experience this week. It's phenomenal. The PBA is uh, the greatest tour in the world. It's where the best bowlers in the world are, and it's where I want to be. And uh, for me, the amateur scene is an unbelievable scene, but eventually you have to, uh, you know, jump in the deep end with the big boy. Now, I, you know, I, I have to ask you about this two-handed style, which, quite honestly, I think it's one of the most amazing things I've ever seen. You're the best I've ever seen at it. How did you arrive at this two-handed style? Well, basically, I started when I was 18 months old. My family built a bowling center where I live in Orange, and uh, the bowling ball was just a little too heavy for an 18-month kid. So I used to just push it down, and uh, basically, as I was getting older, I still couldn't pick up, like, uh, a 10-pound ball. Those were the lightest we had at the time, and I used to just pick it up and kind of dump it on the lane, and then as I got older again, started putting my fingers in it, and, well, the rest is really history. I just kept on doing it. Thanks very much, Jason. Randy, no problem, mate. Cheers. To Belmonte, the two-handed man. Uh, needed that for the globe. Control. Oh, blackjack, blackjack, blackjack. Well, we have seen a oh, trouble. Oh. That's a troubling oh. strike. Perfect. Oh, come on, come on. Belmonte in the eight. Roll. Yes! You have no idea how good this feels. <laughs> Gets them all to drop. Working off a strike here in the third. Belmo gets them all to drop. To drop them all. Belmonte in the fifth. Strike in the sixth. Same deal. Pretty good. And that'll do it. Just like that. And finding it. Turns, which you do on the shark, you know, you normally go to the top. It says a lot there, doesn't it? 
over and dominate. Close, close. Come on. Oh, no. Didn't like it. One more time. One time, one more time. Yes. Big four bagger for Belmo. What a closing job by Belmonte. Oh, oh goodness. Push. <laughs> They're not very good, but... Australia. Strikes in a row. Heaves it in the second. His effort in the tenth. Yep, he's perfect after three, four frame here. Just shreds the rack, all the power and speed. Working his advantage, four in a row now, working on a Robstone. Nine. Four on the right lane, a little loft. Two-handed. Whoa, loft. Nessa curve around the ball. Return. Like his effort in the fifth a little bit more. Randy, a little late kick there on the 10 pin. That's his first strike of the match. Yeah, he cut to you. Chance. Go, baby. Right at 250. Ball nice and straight and fast. Five in a row. Final, one more to come after this one. Good frame. Number six. Come on. Oh, here it comes, Singer. Yeah! Five in a row.